my dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus. On 14th January, every year, we celebrate the feast of Saint Felix of Nola. He was coming from the place of Nola near Italy. His father was Hermias, who had two sons, Felix and Hermias. He kept all his possessions and wealth for his two sons. Hermias chose his life as an army officer, whereas Felix chose his life as an army man for Jesus Christ. He wanted to live for Jesus because he experienced and encountered Jesus as his Lord and Master. So he spent all his life, wealth and possessions for all the people around him who were needy and the marginalized. Because of his virtuous life, he was ordained as a priest by the Bishop of Nola, Maximus. Later, he succeeded him as a Bishop of Nola. In the year 250, Bishop Maximus was caught by the persecutors of the Emperor Decius. And the aid, Felix also was caught and he was put into a dungeon by the emperor's followers. But one fine night, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in the dungeon and told him to go to the desert and help the bishop of Nola, Maximus. As the angel commanded him, he got freed from the dungeon and went in search of Bishop Maximus in the desert. He found him unconscious and because of God's grace, he regained consciousness because of the help of Felix and later he assisted him all throughout his life. When Maximus died as a bishop of Nola, Felix was approached to become the bishop, but he denied and Quintinus became the bishop of Nola. He lived an austere and spiritual life and he wanted to live a life of silence. As an old man, he died and his followers erected a basilica in honor of Felix. Saint Paulinus of Nola and his companions erected a great basilica in honor of Saint Felix. In fact, this great saint is a model for our Christian life. He is a man who lived for faith and his life is a message for each of us to follow the Lord.